Uncola for me, please. Well, where is he? He'll be here. Another fly-by-night character. Good evening, my beauty. Roses. Oh, they're beautiful. Aren't they beautiful, Jeffrey? Flowers. Don't touch the thorns. Vladimir, I'd like to introduce you to my psychiatrist, Dr. Jeffrey Rosenberg. Jeffrey, Count Dracula. It's a pleasure to meet you, Dr. Rosenberg. Likewise, Count. Please call me Vladimir. And I will call you Shrink. We are in America. Did you have a nice day, my beauty? Well, Rene ran my ass off all day. I mean, he may be the best photographer in New York City, but he's still a bitch. Now, now, darling. They have a right to their life. Yes, I know, Jeffrey. They love in their way, we love in ours. Who's to say which is right? By the 21st century, homosexuality will probably be the normal lifestyle. Excellent. Cigarette. Do not smoke. Thank you very much. The mirror is broken. A small accident. Forgive me, Doctor. Oh, I almost forgot. I bought you something, too, darling. Really? For me? Oh, how sweet. What is it? It's a good luck necklace. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's, it's very interesting. Oh, God, it smells awful. Yes, it's made of garlic. Garlic? I don't think that's funny, Jeffrey. Garlic. You're getting to be a bore, Rosenberg. Von Helsing, Count Dracula. My grandfather was Dr. Fritz von Helsing. I changed my name to Rosenberg for professional reasons. He practiced in London. Is the name familiar to you? Von Helsing. I should have known. Your grandfather was a very wise man. But unfortunately for him, I was wiser. Yes, but the race goes on, What Count. the hell are you men talking about? Are you stoned, Jeffrey? Did you sneak a joint out of my purse? Let him continue. It's most amusing. You won't find this amusing, Count. But have you there some, some wolfbane? Something more powerful than wolfbane. Well, Count, what do you say to that? I would say leave Cindy alone and find yourself a nice Jewish girl, Doctor. Hmm? Ah, uh, shit. It's the other one, isn't it? Good evening, Dr. Rosenberg. Better luck next time. One last thing. I have no more time for games, Dr. Rosenberg. Look into my eyes, Count Vladimir Dracula. Look deeply into my eyes. You are getting sleepy. Knock it off, Jeffrey. I'm starving. I'm going to have you find the truth out about this man one way or the other, Cindy. Sleepier and sleepier. Do not teach your grandmother how to suck eggs, Rosenberg. It is you who's getting sleepier and sleepier. You are falling into a deep sleep. Pleasant. Warm. Close your eyes. Soon you will be under my power. Look it, I can't stand much more of this competitive macho shit, you guys. I'm warning you. Sleepier and sleepier, Count. Drowsier and drowsier, Rosenberg. You're almost asleep by now. No, you are. No, you are. You are. No, you are. That's the circus you will be possible to kill. Are you gentlemen? Who's there? Cindy! Cindy! Oh, it's you. Hey, why don't you just go back to the plaza and play your little boy games with Jeffrey? Open the door. I can't. I have company. I don't want to be disturbed. Very cute. I told you, I have got a man in here. Now you do. Why, you arrogant SOB. I am Dracula, a great power, 
And yet I'm humbled before you. You're the only woman I've ever loved. You belong to me. Look it, I'm not your slave. Now I've asked you nicely to leave. Now I'm gonna call the police. I mean it. You sought experience, and none has satisfied you. You long for something wild and overpowering, sweep you beyond thought. I heard a rooster crow. A rooster? In New York City? It is late. I must go. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Come on. You can go to bed. Maybe get in a little quickie. No. With you, never a quickie. Always a long key. Until tonight. Hey, when you come back tonight, it's okay to use the front door. <laughs>